My dudes, my guys, my freaking boys. Let's go rip Skyline Drive. This is what we're taking. It's my 1991 Honda Civic Wagon with a D16A6 Vitara piston bottom end. And uh, it's a still stock A6 head, non VTEC. And it's all wheel drive and it's got a 54 millimeter turbo. And as long as we don't rip the exhaust out of it, it's pretty reliable. All right, the boys are almost here. Let's get out of here. We're only 72 miles in and we already broke the exhaust bar. But, got Zell with us? <laughs> That's Marcus. <hard, bro. laughs> got Marcus with us, the boy? <laughs> we out here. We're still trucking. The exhaust we hasn't... <laughs> the exhaust hasn't folded under the car yet, so we're good. So we made it to the gas stop, which is right before uh, Skyline Drive. The issue is that we definitely grenaded the exhaust into two pieces. So now we try to find an exhaust shop that'll let me just put the car on the lift and weld some stuff, which I feel like 0% chance of that happening, or do we just send it? So I might get on my phone real quick and look up and see see what uh, what we can find. All right, we just pulled up to the O'Reilly's right here. I got an idea. I think if we can get a band clamp, might be able to like band clamp the thing back together. I don't think it's gonna work, but we'll see if they have one. We have hit the jackpot, fellas. Now we just gotta see if they have the right size. That's a five inch? We don't need five inch, brother. Two and a half. See, the only thing is I don't think it's wide enough because that flex pipe is four inches wide. This is definitely not four inches wide. We had a local tell us to try some shop up the way and like their Google pictures have Hondas on it. So let's hope for the best. Uh, we got stuff to hopefully fix it. We just need a jack and a Sawzall or a cutoff wheel or something like that. All right, fellas, we are at uh, this shop here. Luckily they let us borrow tools. This is what we came up with. Hopefully that will be good enough to get us home and then I can order some more stuff from Vibrant and get a new downpipe built. But for now, hopefully that works. All right, we're back. We're back on the road. I'll tag that shop below. Super shout out to them because we would have been screwed, but it's all together for now. Uh, the only bad part is like the front's really long and doesn't have like the clamp on it. So if it like catches and folds back, it's just going to be stuck under the car until it drags off. But. The boys don't care, right? Right? Don't right? Care. Right? Right? We get, we get, yeah, yeah, yeah. We out here. We made it. We're at the entrance, and there's literally a speed bump right here. So let's hope all that exhaust work doesn't just get ripped out right now. I dragged a little bit, but I think we're all right. All right, we made it. Now all we got to do is worry about the uh, that axle binding because it does that. But we we've made it inside of the park, so. Mission mostly successful so far. 75%. Yeah, 75%. <laughs> so basically all the Skyline Drive thing is we're just going to go and drive around and pull off at different uh, outlooks so you can see stuff like this. It's crazy. You can see for like miles out. Pretty nutty. We don't really have stuff like this around us, so it's pretty cool. And they're all taking pictures, being camera people. So far, our exhaust fix is working, so we'll take that. It still has a little bit tiny leak, but that's much better than the exhaust being in two pieces. So, I actually, I actually rolled it. Oh, wait, where was I? Oh, there you go. Oh, yeah, I
All right, so we pulled off because the exhaust started dragging a little bit. And what the issue is, is that the down pipe is just held on by like a V-band. There's no other like secondary point. So what's happening is I think whenever we hit the gas, the motor's like rocking a little bit and is dropping the down pipe down and making it uh, hit the ground. But we do have an issue or we do have a, a solution, right? So, <laughs> so I went up through between the wheel and the mud flap and we got the, uh, the old exhaust fixer 6,000 right here. And I found it down there and we just like kind of put it in there and pried the exhaust up. So we might have to do that a couple times this trip, but yo, for the roadside fixes, I mean, hey, I mean, I mean, I said, it's all right. <laughs> Multiple side quests. Yeah, yeah. Boy's out here beefing, dog. Sheesh. Fighting with the cameras. It's like a sword fight, but a camera fight. <laughs> Sir! Hey, yo, 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 yo. <laughs> what a view. Crazy. That was super cool. We just had a talk with a couple from uh, over in the UK. Said he had his uh, Impreza. So that was pretty neat. He's checking out the wagon, but got it parked up here next to this tunnel. Should be a cool little spot as I impede traffic. <laughs> All right, fellas, I kind of want to climb up there. They're sitting here doing photography stuff. Your boy might make a trek. If I fall, I'm screwed. Fellas. I'm out of shape. It is a hike hike up here. Sheesh. Got me breathing, breathing. Ugh. Had a Datsun and uh, Eclipse and something else pull up. So I guess we're gonna go down there and talk to them real quick. I think these are the fastest NPCs we've been behind so far. It's a Prius and like a Chevy 1500, but they're actually not going like 15 miles an hour onto the speed limit, so it's kind of nice. Prius is getting there. I'm not gonna lie to you. I know he's having fun. All right, we found a hiking trail. It's like a mile out and a mile back, so I guess we're gonna go be adventurous. So far, wagon's doing pretty good. Whose bad idea was this? Mine. Help. Doing, Help. SOS. Send the paramedics. Help. <laughs> All right, we made it. Nice little easy peasy hike. <laughs> it was not easy peasy. Crazy. Crazy view. All right, the GoPro died, but we made it back and we didn't die. So, Zell, maybe, maybe a little, maybe a little. <laughs> All right, I died. let's get out of here. All right, y'all, we made it to the end. Well, not the end, but the end for us. So, we're out of here. And hopefully we're going the right way because I don't think we know where we're going. Park Ranger, let me put this away. Now we're down in the cut, driving down off the mountain, and a random EK Civic appeared behind us. And I feel like we're gonna rip the exhaust out this month. Here again. I said, let's do it! <laughs> YOLO. So the car's back home and we have been 320 miles. So our little 320 mile adventure is over. And the only damage that we had was the uh, the downpipe, which I called that before we even left the house. I knew that was gonna happen, but we were able to get it fixed up enough to still have a good time. So yeah, let me know. Uh, let me know if you guys like adventure type videos like this. I can do some more. So appreciate y'all for watching. I'll see y'all later. Peace.